All right, so today is a beautiful day because it is PR day. I'm gonna do my one rep max on deadlift, squat, and bench. Currently uh, 5'10", about 170. So uh, this is sort of the beginning, not really the beginning, but somewhat of the beginning of the journey to uh, a thousand pound club. So let's see what we can do today. Lightweight. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Fucking nice. Too heavy?
just wanted to finish this video about my road to the thousand pound club. I realize it's the day, well, it's two days after now. Um, had to uh, take care of some things. I'm not always just making videos while I'm out here, obviously. But um, as you just saw, the three big lifts, the deadlift, squat, and bench, respectively, I pulled 315, three plates on deadlift, and then 275 on squat, uh, which I was pretty happy about considering that I never really do squats for weight, back squats for weight. And then only 205 on bench, which was a little bit disappointing uh, because I feel like majority of the strength uh, that I generally speaking have is on the upper half, uh, but apparently it didn't happen. So uh, certainly a lot of work to do, but uh, yeah, so that makes a total of 795, so almost 800. And uh, that's about 200 pounds away from 1,000, which is a significant jump. So I'm gonna say right now that that's a pretty lofty goal to hit 1,000 pounds um, on all three uh, total um, in the next six months. So that's sort of a, a goal that I have, but I definitely want to overshoot, uh, you know, in terms of you know, what my actual goal is, relatively speaking, so that I have a, a benchmark uh, to hit that's higher than what uh, might realistically be possible, so that if I do hit that, I would definitely surprise myself, uh, because that would require probably cl close to about four plates on deadlift, uh, a little over 315, a little over three plates on squat, and then at least, you know, two, 235, 245 on bench. Uh, and so again, right now my focus is hitting that thousand pounds um, on the big three and putting on as much you know, muscle mass as possible. So really my routine consists of a lot of drinking these, uh, not a sponsored video, this is not just about optimum nutrition protein shakes, but this one's pretty good. Um, and I've been eating a lot of chopped chicken. So every day, uh, obviously, being here, with access to the DFAC or the chow hall rather, and it's uh, pretty damn good. And I honestly don't see why anybody complains about chow hall food because it's free. And so, if you're paying for it, that's one thing, but free food is really like why are you complaining because it's free. Free food is always good um, to, a, to a degree. But uh, chopped chicken is an offering at the chow hall, and I always get. Uh, two to three, I try to do, put down about three chopped chickens at every meal, so lunch and dinner, and then breakfast I'll do uh, four egg whites um, with turkey sausage patties and a uh, decent amount of other fruits and veggies and, and carbs, but uh, primary thing is protein. Uh, I'm experimenting with different methods of, of eating, so to speak, because, you know, obviously a lot of what goes in comes out, uh, not, you know, <laughs> we're gonna, so, I don't know if I'm gonna include that part of it, but you know, obviously I'm not, uh, you know, putting all of that food to work in terms of, you know, building the muscles uh, because uh, frankly, I am shitting a lot of it out. And uh, the protein I think is a big part of that, which I want to kind of dial in what I can actually process in my body. Uh, I'm probably eating close to about 200 grams of protein a day. Um, between about you know five to six chopped chickens, uh, at least probably close to a quart of 1% milk every meal, among other things that they have in the defect, whether it's you know they have ribs or if they have uh, you know like scallops occasionally, uh, you know steak, and you know whatever whatever other uh, protein offerings. I try to just put down as much as possible, really, and. Um, I might have to dial that back a little bit and cre increase the carb intake. So I have maybe, you know, more energy to work out and uh, actually process more of that protein if I have, you know, more fiber. So I'm gonna see what works here in the next, uh, you know, few months, few weeks and uh, really work on dieting correctly so I can gain as much weight as possible. Uh, that being said, I am trying to increase my weight by about five pounds per month, which is also a pretty lofty goal. Uh, again, I'm 5'10", uh, 170 right now, and uh, that's pretty much, you know, including water weight. When I got here, I was about 160, give or take. So I've gained, give or take, like 5 or 10 pounds of, of actual weight. If I dropped down, you know, was dehydrated right before bodybuilding show, I'm sure I'd be probably about a lean, like 160, 165. But if I can get up to about 185, 190, cut back 5 to 10 pounds and just...
All right, my phone seems to be running out of memory space, but I'm also speaking a lot and not actually saying a whole lot. So I'm just gonna cut it and uh, step on the scale to give you guys an idea what my actual weight is right now. And then probably just wrap up the video here. So here we are at the scale. I don't have anything in my pockets. I'm just wearing shorts and a tank top. My shoes would probably add maybe a pound, if that. So you can probably see that it says 169. That's a great number right there, 169, okay? So hopefully the next time I'm recording a segment about my journey to the 1,000 pound club, I'm quite a bit closer. I'm gonna try to PR at least once a month. No, actually about once a month. Um, probably closer to once every two months because I wanna actually get good lifts in and increase my recovery time a little bit so I'm able to actually increase those numbers. Uh, the next time I step on the scale, hopefully I'm a bit heavier as well. And so uh, stay tuned for that update. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like down below. Comment if you guys have any questions. Seems to be my standard ending to all these videos. Uh, but yep, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one.